I lift my balls everywhere I go. What a feat it is. And how I love it so. <laughs> Good morning, friends, and welcome back to The Escapists. My name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator. And I am glad to be back. I have a little bit of a plan. Um... I happen to notice a generator, which might come in quite handy. Well, first we better make sure we're not getting our cell searched. Oh, and also, what do father have? What do father have? Sheet metal wire. I'll take sheet metal. We could possibly upgrade our, our shovel one more time, as I had hoped to do. J.D. Arnold and cold cut. Well, no problem there. I'll help you out with that cold cut desk search. Probably JD too. It's right over there. Got a plunger. Why do you have a plunger? Just tell me. <gasps> duct tape! Duct tape! Woo! I love me some sticky ducky duct tape! Woo! Now I'm searching father's desk for duct tape! Woo! Sun has a chocolate bar, it's full of sugar for me. Alright, drop this shit, drop that shit. Pick up this one and that, okay. <laughs> Surprise, he didn't just... What's that you got there? Duct tape, huh? No. Maybe I should buy the wire. I kind of want to make another fake fence, like if we're gonna go... Try and do some shit with that generator. Ah, I really would like to escape this place. Please, just let me go. Why will you not just let me go? Lightweight shovel. Meh. Somebody else has some stuff for me. Show me the money! Nope. Sock soap. Can make a sock mace. Comb blade. I think that's better than what I got. Probably. There you go. I leave this for you. You'll like. Oh, there's another one here. Fortuitous! And did you see that shit pop up way over here? Man! They're popping up like, well, weeds. <laughs> ah. Quite nervous about the escape attempt. As usual. How long do we have after the generator shuts off? Is there a way out from that way? Damn. I wish I had a staff or utility key. So I could figure that one out. Kind of dig around a little bit. Oh. There were two there, but I don't need two. You guys don't pay me enough for that shit. <laughs> Ah, you guys change up your inventories? Nah, everybody's fucking working and shit. Everybody's working. I'm gonna fucking work too. Today is a uh, fucking biceps and shoulders. Tomorrow's fucking thighs and calves. It's pretty good, you know. Protein shake in the morning. Uh, eat some chicken breast for lunch. Uh, eggs, eggs. It's good for breakfast, you know. Uh, maybe nice, nice, nice steak for dinner. You know, sometimes just a nice peanut butter and jelly sandwich, that's all you really got time for. But you need to pack the protein in, you know, that's all I'm saying. If you wanna, if you wanna bulk up, really. If you, if you just wanna tone, you know, that's great, you can just run or something like that, but everybody's gonna think you're a little, a little pussy. So, you really should bulk up, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> I do, bro! I lift! What are you talking about? <laughs> I lift... My balls. Everywhere I go. What a feat it is. And how I love it so. <laughs> Alright. Everybody's like, on a mat and shit. I want a mat. Duct tape! A oh, woohoo! Now we just need a little more fucking shovely action. It will be so good. Or a little more sheet metal action. 
then we'll get some super shovel going. Super shovel time! Uh-oh, Cold Cut and Leo? No, Leo and JD. Damn, that was a thing. You really should have run after after punching that guy. So the guards don't knock you out and take your shit, see? It's possible. It's factual. Everything is satisfactual. Zippity doo da, you guys don't have shit. I'll see you later. I need to check my desk. Yeah, we ain't got shit to combine with this duct tape. But at least I got it. That's all I'm saying. Whatever. I'll go back to the gym, bro. Fucking meathead today. Yeah. I don't want to kick anybody off this exercise mat, you know, because that is rude. And I think uh, people in prison have nice manners. Is that is that a, a stereotype? No, it's not. But it should be. Wouldn't it be great if we just had a bunch of gentlemen in prison? In top hats and monocles? Raping each other? What? That's not cool. That's not cool! Rape isn't funny. Right. <laughs> oh, more shower time. I've just been fucking beefing it today, bro. Giving you some exercise tips and shit. It'll probably give you a heart attack, but... You'll fucking look good in your coffin. I'll have to buy you a double wide coffin. Oh shit. Is that Leo? Or JD selling some shit? Yeah. Hey, man. Sheet metal! What, what? Fuck yeah, sturdy shovel. Fuck yeah, sturdy shovel. Now we gotta do the thing. Alright, so we need that duct tape. And... Fuck yeah. Sturdy shovel in one day, son! Oh, no, 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 no. There's sun right now. Speak of the devil! There's even more sheet metal. Fuck. They really wanted me to craft that shit up. I don't remember how to, uh, to make, like, padded POW outfit, book, duct tape. Hmm. I wonder if we could do metal and duct tape. And make, like, instead of padded, it could be armor-plated kind of shit. Be the most badass prisoner ever. Fucking punkin' everybody. What are you doing in here, father? You're not allowed to be in here. I'm the police. You got something? Fox? Fox? God damn it. Officer TOS, I want him bruised. Nah. Nah. What do you want me to do? Nah. Fuck that. <laughs> what what do you want? Nah, fuck. I don't feel like doing that. Oh shit. It's going down. Father beat up cold cut. What? Wow. I'll take this file. Hopefully we don't get searched tonight and fucking... I have to flush some shit down the toilet. I mean... Never mind. Not gonna explain. Flush shit down the toilet. You know what I mean by that. I hope. Warden Craig Monkford. <laughs> I love the warden's names. It is so hilarious! God damn it. I also love evening meal. Hmm. I don't know why I took this file. There's not much I can do with this file. Got a fucking chocolate mountain in my desk once more. That's no surprise. Now I gotta do my fucking gardening job, stupid shit! Every day, day in, day out. Fucking go weed, go weed! I'm tired of it, alright? I'm just tired of it. It's really the only reason I was escaping. If you let me sleep in my cell, like, just gorged on sleeping pills for a couple of years, I might actually consider staying. But no, you're like, work. So I'm like, fuck it. I'm getting out. You guys don't pay me enough for this shit. Nah, dude. Nah. Uh, here we go. Kinda got like a little a, a little pattern established, a little rhythm down to this weed and shit. Maybe. Until I just said something about it. God damn it, where are the weeds? There. 
Ah. There's two there. But I ain't doing it. You guys don't pay me enough for that shit. <laughs> nope. Nope. Nah. uh Come on, fucking beef up some more. Meathead, meathead, meathead! Yeah! Oh, it's so good. Being able to defend one's self and loved ones. And people call you a meathead for it, bro, but you're not. You're not, bro. Also, don't forget to drive a truck. As soon as I get out with my fucking 54 bucks, I'm, I'm buying a truck. Shittiest truck you've ever seen. 1942 Ford fucking T-Model. <laughs> Whatever the fuck it is, I don't know. I think this is going pretty good. I get get my sweat on. Oh, yeah. It's pretty hard to get your fucking speed and strength up to 100. Compared to getting my intelligence up to 100. Look at that shit. Fucking 21 speed. God damn. That's horrible. What does it even do? I guess it probably increases your punching speed or something like that. But that's boring as shit! He ain't got another vomit. He did change up inventory, however. Don't be fooled. Hmm. Y'all having a good time? That's great. I gotta go and check in vain if anybody's fucking desk has changed. Yay! I just want that one last piece of equipment that's gonna fucking make all the difference and shit. This tin foil. But I think we've uh, quite moved past that now. Yes. Evening roll call. The moment of truth. I dropped my hoe there. Actually, I'm gonna pull this shit out of my desk. Cause you know they're gonna call my fucking name. Just, just to be a bunch of dicks. Um, is that it? All right. That seems to be it. Hello, everyone! Hi, Dr. Nick. No, hi, everybody. God damn it. Fucked it up. Your greetings about to get their cell search. Father and Sean Arnold. Good. Good, 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 good. Then I got some stuff to do. Gotta put this shit away. Gotta go jack somebody's bed make a fucking dummy. Boop, 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 boop. Throw blankets on the floor. You guys can have one blanket each. I'm a nice guy. Not completely heartless. Good, good, good. Well, uh... I guess we could switch... Switch outfits. Mm-hmm. Why isn't he at roll call? Cause fuck you! That's why! Doing what I want, Dayton does! Fake fence, couple chocolate bars. Alright. <clears throat> Hopefully that's gonna be enough. I'm quite nervous, as per usual. But here we go. Out into the dark. And... Generator. Yeah, there is a guy that patrols over there to check it. But we should be through this long before he gets back. I've been, I've been talking like a Khajiit in and, in and out because of my Morrowind roleplay. If you haven't checked out that series, it's pretty enjoyable as well. If you like the laid back nature of the escapists. Alright. Fake fence. And then I'll fucking... Yeah. Just need to get through here. That's not going as quickly as I'd hoped. Still a decent clip, though. And then... That guy's gonna come patrol. Yeah. <laughs> well, that was quite a thing. I think we should be a little careful. While we're out here doing the thing, gotta put the wall block back in place relatively quickly, eat some chocolate. 
Eat some chocolate. Keep that stamina going. Alright. So here we go. Click. And then cut. Faster, faster. You must cut. We must escape. Fuck you. Yeah. Do it up, boy. Sweet freedom! Yes! Fuck yeah, dude. I love this game so much. I hope you've enjoyed as well. I hope you'll check out the YouTubers in the description. 18,000, I think it's better than my last score, so... So we're doing good, boy, let me tell you what. Ah, so this has been Stalag Fluked of The Escapists. I do hope that you will join us for the next time, friends. And that you will like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Until then, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.